guys, it's me, the Red Encryption, and today we're gonna be doing something unexpected today. I will try to talk about the flat earth, the, not the shape of the earth, but whatever. No. Here are my questions about the flat earth. Number one, what is this? What is this? This is a sunset that cannot happen on the flat earth. Here's why. On the flat earth map, the sun is like a spotlight and is zooming around the earth in circles, like chasing its own tail, as if it had a tail. This means it won't ever set, because setting means going below the horizon, and that can't happen on the FEE model, because the sun will just zoom away to another part of the earth, according to the FEE model. One down, some more to go. Third question. What would NASA gain from this? Answer in the comment section below. Actual question number two. Why just NASA? Why not ESA or Roscosmos or CNS or DLR or JAXA or uh, ASI or CNSA or ISRO or AXA or CSA or CARI or A ASA or AIB and SSAV or CONE or ISRC? INTA, NSO, SINSA, SUPARCO, SANSA, SSO, or AEM. Why only NASA? Tell me, please. I want to hear what you have to say. Why only NASA? What happened there? There are a lot of space agencies out there, well, some of which are listed here, and they all agree that the Earth is a globe. It requires all the countries, you know, which has the space agencies, to agree on it, as well as actually, quote-unquote, Fool us, and you know as well as I know that that is a very hard thing to pull off. This is only the tip of the iceberg when it comes to all the scientific proof and the visual proof that goes in depth much further than what I'm giving you right now. Here are six pictures of the big blue globe that all of you FE seem to be scared about. One of them was taken by NASA, the others by foreign associations. Guess which ones were made by NASA and which ones aren't by NASA. The pics are courtesy of NASA, JIA, CNSA, CSA, SARCO, and ISRO. Six different agencies, six different countries, one big blue globe. So tell me what you think, and I'll see you next time.